So back from doing doing cardio, um, fasted. It's 45 minutes on a cross trainer, and just making breakfast. But I thought I'd make a full day of eating video. I'm on keto this week, so um, I'm just gonna take you through my normal day. Starting with now, normally when I make this, it looks so perfect and it flips perfectly in half and for some reason this time even though I've had the heat on lower it's just it's all botched up but it's a salmon egg salmon egg omelette no salmon and feta omelette <laughs> right. so normally it's like you know perfectly half moon shaped it's all broken up and I don't even know why so that's what I'm gonna have for my breakfast and I think I think there's also a side of avocado. Let me just check my fitness pal. Let's have a look. Come on, it takes so long to load. Oh I'm just impatient. Yeah, so um 50 grams of avocado to go with that as well. And yeah, that's it. So I'm going to plate this up and I'll show you when it is ready, which it almost is now. So see you in a sec. Alright, so back from um, the GP and going to go gym in about an hour. There's a thing called keto fog. So anyone that's done keto is looking to do keto. A few days into it, you get this mind fog, tiredness, drained feeling. It's normal, but it's annoying. And it's hit me today. Well, all I'm gonna have now is uh, my keto flatbread with a serving of peanut butter. But with the keto flatbread, I've made it already. Made it in the oven. Wait till it was cooked and then I'm toasting it on the grill so it should come out nice and crispy like um, toast and then I'm going to spread the peanut butter on that so I'll show you when I take it out of the oven nice right, so that's them done Gonna finish it off with a little sprinkle of sweetener. I would want honey on it, but I can't have honey. So, a bit of sweetener will have to do. All right, so I'm gonna eat this now, and then I might take like a 15 minute nap, because I'm really, really tired, really tired. And for my beverage, got myself a Fanta Zero. Save my caffeine for my workout. Um, so I will eat that, have a nap, and then I will see you at the next meal after the gym. So it'll be my post-workout meal. See you later. Uh, so both Naish and I are very tired. I'm just taking a nap. I feel like I should take one too, but I'm actually answering <clears throat> all of your comments. I like responding to, to comments, it gives me a personal feel, like a connection. Um, has anyone else noticed when they're dieting, cooking shows seem to be like the, the thing to watch all the time. It's like you can't eat it so you might as well watch it. Yeah. It's making me hungry. Yeah, just going through these... Um, these comments and a little shout out to Alex Aregun. I think that's how I said it. If I said it wrong, then sorry. He's from San Bernardino. 
a new subscriber welcome he asked me to give him a shout out so there you go he's 46 and he's still lifting so yeah good on him that's what i'll be doing too so something to be proud of anyway i'm gonna finish responding to these and then it's gym time so i will see i might put a couple highlights i want to try and hit 140 to 150 kg on the floor press so um if i manage to do it i will put some highlights on the screen if not i failed and i failed you all sorry but anyway see you at the gym all right, so now just sorting out my pre-workout nutrition, or should I just say my pre-workout shape, which is, see if it focuses, Focus, Nitroflex by GAT. I take one scoop, because it says only take one scoop, I also take clear muscle, focus, and BCAAs, which I'm running very low on, by my protein, focus, focus, there we go, and that's it, so chest day, I'm on a stupid pump. So I will show you the highlights of my floor press if I get above 135 kilos, pounds on the screen now. So um, yeah, I will see you later. Go, let's go. Oh, uh, one, two, let's go. Three, let's go. Four. Go. Alright, so home from the gym. Really good chest session. I hit the 140 on the floor press. Quite happy with that for four sets of five and then the first set I did 130. So good progression there. But now on to the post-workout meal. So I got um, cooked and sliced chicken breast with some uh, cheddar cheese, Got three rashes of bacon and some homemade pico de gallo. Literally addicted to it and it's Christian's fault. I blame him. But um, yeah, I'm gonna eat, chill for a bit. I didn't get to take a nap earlier so I might take a nap before I do some work and then on to the next meal. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so second to last meal. I had a few problems with um, upgraded to Yosemite on um, my MacBook. And it just keeps freezing on the um, boot screen. So it's been a long process trying to get this video edited. But let's look at what I got to eat. All right, so I've got avocado, some more pico de gallo, and chicken breast with some cheddar cheese. I'm gonna try and finish editing this video because it needs to go up tomorrow, and um, I'll see you for my final meal. All right, so I've just managed to, fight. I think the, the new settings on, um, so I need to make sure I don't cover the microphone again, but um, the new settings on Final Cut Pro are a bit, they're all in different places and things aren't the same as the last one so it's a bit hard to kind of get my head around but I think I've sorted it so video is processing now but um, I was just watching the news and there was um, it makes me a bit more sad because it's like um, nice is pregnant and I can't imagine someone actually doing it but um, a woman in South London as well, which makes it worse, was um, beaten up on the street and she was kicked in the stomach to the point that the baby died and um, she still had to give birth to it. That's horrible, she was like 30, 
so I think they said 32 weeks, I can't actually remember exactly, but that's horrible. And then it turns out it's the ex-boyfriend. I mean, come on, like, I don't know, that, that sickens me. That really sickens me. I know this has nothing to do with a full day of eating, but I just thought, let me share this with you guys, because, you know, that that's, that's disgusting. Yeah, I'm gonna have my last meal. It's just gone eight o'clock now. I'm gonna have my last meal around about nine o'clock. Try and get an early night. Didn't get an early night yesterday and start to get up for cardio, so it's, it was quite a tiring day and I didn't get to have any naps at all during today because I was trying to figure out this bloody computer and the new operating system. But um, yeah, I will check you guys at the next meal, which will be in about an hour. All right, so on to the final meal of today. This is such a makeshift meal. It was meant to be like, I made like burgers using um, the muscle food, um, extra lean mints. And um, hold on, let me just turn on the TV. Cool. Um, yeah, so I made burgers using the extra lean mints from muscle food. And it was meant to be a feta cheese and avocado. So it's been really nice. But I ran out of feta cheese. So I rummaged the cupboard. I had a little bit of grated parmesan cheese and ground almonds. So I just put it all on a plate. Don't know how it's gonna taste. Got some mustard, classic yellow mustard, just in case it's a bit. No. Nah. But um, yeah, let's have a look. Yeah, so there is. Really not sure how it's gonna taste. But we'll see. I'll actually do this on camera and see how I'm dreading it a little bit. Let's see. Let's just try the the beef with the parmesan and oven. Oi, shut up. That's nice. Yeah. Right about now I'd I probably like anything but that's not bad that's not bad at all might put a bit of you know, mustard on it this is my last meal still got my water to drink so that concludes this full day of eating I'll do another one as I approach the show um, especially I think a lot of guys want to know want an idea of how to eat during like the final week and stuff so I'll probably do one kind of mid final week and then um, yeah, may maybe carb up um, depending on what my carb up's gonna be like. So stay tuned, let me know if you do wanna see that. Um, so I don't, you know, just put up videos that you don't wanna see. That concludes this video. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and until next time, Peace. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I run it, I never front it. I got my whole cool life on it. Big, 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 big